The deleting of just about anything sounds like such a simple affair, right? Of course it does. And for the most part, deleting something on your computer, your phone, or your website should be as simple as clicking delete. However, if you've ever used certain applications, such as the Evolution Groupware suite, you might be familiar with the idea that simply clicking delete doesn't always do the trick. In some cases, deleting a file or object removes it from one location and moves it to another. There's a good reason for this, as sometimes you'll delete an item unintentionally only to have to restore it to where it belongs. That safekeeping feature has come in handy for me on several occasions. The same holds true with Bitwarden. You might find your account contains a lot of unused items, causing your vault to get overly cluttered. When that happens, you want to start deleting those vault items that are no longer valid. However, when you delete a vault item, it doesn't simply disappear. Rather, it's moved to the trash, where it will remain until you permanently delete it or restore it. As you might expect, the process is very simple. Locate and select the vault item you want to delete. Click the trash can icon and the item will be moved to trash. If you then want to permanently delete the item, click trash, select the item in question, and click the trash can icon again. If, on the other hand, you want to restore the item, click the restore icon and it will be returned to your vault. By deleting items that are no longer in use, you make it easier to find the items that are still valid. Move those items to the trash, and only after you're certain you no longer need them, permanently delete them. Note that items sent to the trash will remain there for 30 days, after which they will automatically be deleted. Stay safe, stay organized with Bitwarden.